a city alive with the spirit of excitement and a stadium brimming with anticipation. The build-up has been intense and now we just can't wait for it all to begin. It's anyone's guess though, which team will come out on top? The story of the game as it unfolds live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to one of the most recognisable venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we're getting ready for a quarter-final second leg match in the Champions League. It's Real Madrid against Borussia Dortmund. Well, the first leg was a really good game, Derek. Real chance! Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through, so athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So, underway again here, 1-0 the score. Malin. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Mbappe. Well, he's given us away. Mendy is with Vinicius Junior. Attacking possibilities for Real. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Emre Can. Brandt with it. Phil Krug. Marlin. Dortmund unable to retain possession. A oh, tremendous vision. Mbappe, oh he's blocked it Brandt Emre Can now well doesn't have to do it on his own Marlin well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Mbappe it's with Vinicius Junior. And Bellingham. Just the challenge that was required. Vinicius Junior. And return to Mbappe. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. And Bellingham. And he's in. Oh, it looked as though he might be through. Not so. Riesson. Nico Schlotterbeck. Good use of advantage for Dortmund. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Mbappe. chance here well, the goal here and that would give them a nice cushion it needs to be a good ball into the box and somebody attacking it and cuts inside wonderful block and that is that half time here on the Spanish capital Second half excitement to come, we hope, here at the Bernabeu. The referee has played advantage in Dortmund's favour. Can he play it in? 
He can't hold on to it. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That was miles off target. And time for the change now. Eder Militao. Mendy has it. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. An important interception. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Daniel Malen. Julian Rioson. Vinicius Junior. It needs an accurate cross. The supporters want to see him have a go. Timely intervention. What can Real do from this position? Well, good effort, but he's placed it wide. The ball back with Real now. Decisive pass. Well, full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. I think they were expecting a bit more from that attack. Twenty minutes to go. And Bellingham. And stopping the danger. Rodrigo. Valverde. He fancies it. Well, body in the way. And a no nonsense clearance. Kylian Mbappe. And it's in as they tighten their grip on the tie. Let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. And they deserve it, you have to say. They've been excellent. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Daniel Malin. Niklas Zule. Here's Phil Krug. That is how to keep it out of the net. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. And over it comes. And a struggle to get it away properly. Room to roll for the Merengues here the crowd encouraging him to take it on and saved by the keeper well, there is going to be stoppage time but only the one minute the final whistle then and Real Madrid have secured their progression yeah they were decent over the two games they created lots of chances they played with great energy and they had a well structured game plan they'll certainly be confident going into the next round Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.